Hi, Collective. Siberia from Captain Cards. So this is collective messages for anyone that resonates. These are surprise messages. Please like, subscribe to further connect with me. I will leave everything you need to know in the description box. I keep hearing the goddess. I am goddess. I'm goddess. But I'm still feeling that feminine energy from the collective, the masculines even. Um, let's get out some messages for your surprises that are coming in already. It's a portal. So you're getting a portal, an exit, um, a, a speedier timeline, a shift. So portals are in energetic shifts. Portals are also astral projection. Portals are manifestations and portals are faster or sometimes slower timelines. You can feel them, most definitely. So somebody is trying to hold it together. Somebody is trying to hold on to an existence that they have here. Aquarius energy has to do with communication. This could be inhibiting you from creating. I feel like somebody's holding the line when it comes to love. Like you're holding it. You're holding it down. You're, 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 st somebody's still committed to some type of love situation. But you have this invincible spiritual power to create, to manifest. Um, I feel you, you feel pulled down because you're a people pleaser. Let's get it. Next, 48. I'm hearing 24. There's something about this um, synchronicity coming in. There's something about many working parts allowing the universe to flow. What does the collective need to know about love at this time? There's three, three. Someone's birthday could be on the third, the 14th, the fifth. Look, somebody does want to come towards you. Somebody misses you. Give me more here for love. Somebody could live in a town where there's trains or a town where there is a, like, um, a cathedral for a symphony. Somebody lives near a national, not, not, somebody lives near a state park. Like at least you could live up to 31 miles away from the state park. Somebody's going through an awakening, especially if you're in separation. Um, somebody could be a Taurus or they could have Taurus Sagittarius placements. Hmm. Gemini placements. Give me more. What is this person's next actions in love? They care a lot. They were if they were apathetic or they feel it feels like they are. They just want what they want. Could be a Scorpio, could be a Libra. Something about um, hyper focusing, feeling restricted, receiving receiving a lot of clarity over the last seven to eight days. This could be what's happening in your love situation. What is this person's next action? They do want to come towards you, but they're coming towards you in a, uh, a victim mindset. They're very tired. They remember good memories about you. It's like they're stuck. Pisces, Scorpio energy. They want to be heard. It's like the crony is here. If you're a feminine, you could be a Capricorn, Aquarius. You could be a Sagittarius or have these placements. But you're a healer. Over the next... 48 to 72 hours, you're healing something, you're speaking your truth. You may go ahead and talk to this person. What is the um, what is the advice for those in separation at this time? Thank you. This, there's mind games that you're changing the narrative over. There is a peace. There is a purge. But there's still constraint here. It needs to be balanced out. You're balancing that out over the next five days. Um, you could have been born on the 7th. You could be 47. You could be 34 to 47 years old. Um, 14 days could be significant here. What's going on in career messages for the surprise messages? Um, satisfaction is here. Balancing out things that... Um, you're working on most definitely. I feel like you work better alone. The number nine, the number seven could be significant. I feel like you've balanced out um, like a routine at work. Um, you're smooth. The aphrodisiac is work. It takes your mind off of things. Look, you're a humanitarian at work. You help others. You could work somewhere near water or somebody has to wash something off. You get really dirty after work. Wherever you work, you get really dirty. Um, somebody could work at a chocolate or a, a I, I feel like you work with peanuts or some type of nuts here, grocery store. Somebody could work at a car or a motorcycle shop or somebody could work out in the woods. You don't have to. 
Somebody could work as a CNA bathing others. There's something about having this lightness. Um, it's part of ascension. There is a need of others. There are friends coming towards you. You may have one to three work friends. <laughs> it's like there's no worries when it's with them. Give me more for career and finance. Pisces energy. There's something about getting rid of this excess baggage. Moving on, making adjustments. Somebody is um, traveling for work, or you will be. Um, you could be leaving for about, five, I'm hearing five to seven days. But there's also, there. there's this fear of letting go of, um, it's even things. It's, it says pack rat here. There's this fear of letting go and being responsible. But you've completed cycles, so I know you're moving forward. Good for you, collective. All right, what should the collective know about spirituality in the next 48 hours? And then I'll get out some Kipper cards and we'll close out the reading. It's about choices. Everybody got choices. I'm hearing that um, E-40 song. But you are competent. You are very You are very in tune. Somebody's in tune with their body. Somebody is in tune with being dead on with um, perception. Somebody's in tune with manifesting money. Somebody's tuned with being conscientious. All you have to do is relax and take notes. Yes. And this is this is this is meditation. It is listening to the guidance of um, your soul, which is gut feelings. It is listening to your in intuition, using your third eye um, by seeing discernment. There's thief theft ass energy here that you're putting it to rest. This could be a spirit guide that is blessing you or giving you something while you're asleep. It's a feminine spirit guide. This um, spirit guide could have been a Taurus, could have been a Virgo, or had these placements, could be a Capricorn, could be a Pisces, or a water sign. Hope is here. Somebody is still trying to hold out hope for some type of um, storyline to be fair. Or look, you can see what's going on from afar. You're hearing about it. Next 24 hours, you know something's going down. Give me more here for the hope. Expectation card is here. You could just be bored over the next two days. I feel like you're waiting on your manifestings to come in if you're a water sign. If you are a fire sign, you're getting to see something unfold. If you're an earth sign, don't let a feminine talk some type of way to you. Yeah, there's a main female in reverse for earth signs. Give me more here. What is going on for earth signs? Next 48. I'm sorry, this is a special message. Okay, so you're coming out of some type of victim mindset. There's a main female coming towards you in the reverse. Just, uh, I feel like you're holding the line. For those, <clears throat> excuse me, throat chakra is blocked. <clears throat> Let's get out some fortunes and close out your readings. Please like, subscribe. I'm also available for personal reads at this time. Just message. We also have a P.O. box attached. Uh, I'll attach that in the description box where you can send your gifted decks and I'll read from those. You can send correspondence or donations to cats. Pay attention to your health. There's advice coming in from a friend. You could be seeking counsel about, um, there's root issues here, root chakra, bones, somebody's hands or their heart. Somebody could even be getting some dental work done September. September, the rest of September here as excuse me, recognition, rewards, plenty of material things because I see fruit, watermelon, bread, grains, money path. A path with money is waiting on you the rest of September. Please like, subscribe. Thanks, Collective.